A deep energy retrofit is when we take a house and try to save a significant amounts of energy. We treat the house as a whole. We, we try not to uh, just stop at 5 or 10 percent energy savings. We're really looking to get into the 50, 60, 70 percent energy savings. For this project, we're looking at uh, four houses in the Ithaca area. But first, we're doing a series of tests called time and motion studies. These studies originally come from manufacturing. We're looking specifically at two and a half inch thick, rigid uh, polyisocyanurate. It's a Thermax brand by uh, Dow Building Systems. We've been looking at cutting. Uh, we've been looking at fastening the uh, insulation to the side of a wood frame wall. Uh, we're looking at taping and uh, again breaking down the process into each of many steps and then looking at various options for each of those steps. Um, a major goal for this particular research project is to make deep energy retrofits more affordable. Uh, we've seen that this can be done, we've seen that 50% and more energy savings are possible. Now the question becomes, can we make it affordable? Uh, where did this project originate? The project is being funded by the uh, New York State Energy Research and Development Authority, that's NYSERDA, out of Albany. Uh, the uh, project manager is Greg Pedrick. Greg did a very successful deep energy retrofit research project in the Utica area previously. And so this is really a second round of uh, deep energy retrofit pilots, again with the goal of uh, significant reduction in the, in the uh, construction cost. Uh, the project uh, team is uh, Tatum Engineering out of Ithaca, New York, that's my company, as well as Snug Planet. Snug Planet is an energy efficiency firm based in uh, Ithaca as well, uh, with a statewide reputation for training and a strong reputation for quality work and safety and uh, significant energy savings. And um, the idea was originally came out of Snug Planet. And the test wall behind me was fabricated uh, purposely for this project. It's on the shop floor at Snug Planet. Cutter. This is called a insole knife. It is essentially a smooth blade push saw. Uh, a sharpened blade that um, is used for cutting insulation board. We're going to do the rip test 
using the AccuCutter, but we're going to do the cut once on each side. The blade depth has been set less than yesterday.